y'all back in with another bop or super bop bop and uh we're gonna do something a little bit different uh so today i'm about to cook some food so stay tuned for that um we're about to go to the fish market we're about to pick up this sturgeon yeah i'm gonna try to cook some sturgeon so for those who don't know sturgeon that's where caviar comes from this fish shared the world with dinosaurs and is still here today that is crazy when you think about it so we about to head to this fish market see how much it costs and see what it do so yeah we're on the way to the market hopefully everybody's day is going well and that is a uh, beauty right there i think that's the 60s impala i believe but um besides that how's everybody's day hopefully everybody's day is going great watch this in the morning good morning if you watch this in the afternoon good evening if you watch this at night you better go sleep we just gonna say good night but uh should be interesting like i said i never had it before and uh see how much this thing hitting for and just driving me down there so we can get this food and i know usually we post guns and political stuff but it's always good to post different stuff because i do have a personality as you guys can see that's why you guys are watching me because my personality is amazing Nah, yours is amazing too. That's why you're here. You know, great minds think alike. So we about to hit it. Let's get it. All right. So of course we almost there. We're going to two markets now. This other one, I've been to. I've been to, but I, I want to see if they have it. And then after that, we're gonna go to my go-to. So because I know my go-to for surely gonna have it because they always do. But uh, so yeah, the first one is called Welco. I probably said it wrong, but we're gonna try that out. See what type of uh, fish they got, and uh, let's see if they have it. Hopefully they do. Let's get it. Uh, boom, there it is. Hopefully we can find parking. Let's see how this parking lot looking. Oh, this parking lot looks schmoovy. We here. We live. Have no fear. Bully Flacco is here. If he's not here, I am near. Let's find see if we can find us some good parking real quick. Actually, I'm just pulling right here. In and out like a robbery. Alright. Stuck in right here. All right, so uh, I didn't want to get copyrighted, so we're going to be talking. I always wanted to try the parrotfish, so let me know. That should be another video, trying parrotfish. Uh, the catfish wasn't a bad price when I was looking at it, so they had clams and oysters, and the fact they had sea urchins, that is crazy. I never even know you can even eat sea urchins, but I think that's too exotic for me. I'm not trying no sea urchin to keep it a buck. And I know this place sells sturgeon because they have to sign up saying sturgeon $9 a pound, but they just didn't have any in stock, I guess, at that point. So I guess we just got to try another spot and see if they have it. With now, fortunately, they didn't have what we need. So that was well cold. We actually about to go to my spot. I can't pronounce it. I locally forgot what it's called, but I know where it's at. So, uh, yep. So let's get to it. And that's what I, the, my main two, my little go-to. Usually they always got what I need. That one in Seafood City. Shout out to Seafood City. That's another good fish market if you live in the uh, the Sacramento area. But the next one we're about to go to is like around the corner. It's not too far. We should probably get there in like five minutes if there's no traffic or if people are driving properly. Clear with a them on my feet. PB Rap Simmons. Bitches. And I kick holes on they ass with them. All I want to know, hey, is that bad case? I heard when you hit that road with it, get money, bitch. Off in the game, oh, it ain't no lag in it. She no asked them last, bitch, put y'all all in it. Oh, all for them bitches and lost your mind. These niggas wonder why I play rack. This is complicated. Fuck, I don't even know who the most player yep. is. I ain't put him straight. Right. She got real, boy, you played the bitches. I ain't playing Big parking spaces, big parking spaces, park, park in the back. Like I said, the spot to be. I already know they have it. I have faith. All right, so like I said, this is really my first time really buying Sturgeon. Um, I don't know how much this stuff is hitting for. Type of mid Yeah, of course. 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 Yeah, of course
course, you know what we're here for. You know what we're here. They look kind of small this time. I have a lot. Have it for nine dollars a pound. Let's get it. I think I might get that one. That one might be the one. So, it looks like they don't got that many in there. Too much one on one. They have a live crowd here. Let's see that's the thing. Uh, let's try the big one at the bottom. Yeah? Yeah, let's try that one. Yeah. Man, I go lie, he got to do all the fun part, but we still gotta uh get it on clean Oops, cameras right now. He gotta do the fun part, but now yeah. Alright, so heading back to the car. Um he did most of the fun stuff. So but I still gotta like take the skin off and stuff like that. So I still got stuff to do to the fish when I get back, but I ain't gonna lie, y'all see the catch? That dude had a 14 pound sturgeon. And the crazy part about it is, I was looking at that same fish and I didn't see it till after they pulled it out. So I think I might have had to sick it the second biggest one, but I was gonna buy two, but it looked like one could feed up to six people. So I'm curious how much it, I was gonna take some. I'm curious. Cause you gotta think, bro, just the head alone was heck of big, bro. I'm like, and that fish was tough, bro. But I, I ain't gonna lie, I think catfish is still the toughest fish to put down humanely also drop a comment below on what's your favorite fish how you like to cook it and if you fish what's your favorite fish to catch drop it in the comments below we want to hear it keep that mouth less face well, less face. Face. i swear to god i can't relate with it p.i take bitch. yo boo thing was my latest big that bag she came with it got red bottoms and hit the plate hey though. this players only you ain't gang and you ain't the bro you ain't got homies i got some brothers and some hoes on me you still want the rollie that ap it look more funny baby say she want me ain't trying to hear it girl you gotta show me i might be lonely I don't think she know that I'm really here. Oh, yeah. Wasn't there when we was in the gym. All right, you know, that's my sister phone. Shout out to her. She came out for the food. And you normally cook an avocado oil. Avocado oil is the way. If you ain't never cooked with it, uh, you low-key late. And then for the fish fryer, y'all should try this uh, fish seasoning. Louisiana fish seasoning is actually pretty good. Personally, the Cajun is like the best one. That and the blue pack goes good on really any fish. It's hard to kind of mess that up. Now, the avocado oil brand I got is chosen. It's like $16 a bottle. It's kind of pricey. You're going to need about maybe two to three bottles. But it's worth the money. Also, try uh, grape oil, too. That's go good, too. All right, so this is where it gets freaky. So, the sturgeon wasn't dead when I took it home. It was still moving. And I know you probably say, oh, nerve muscles and all that stuff. Oh, that's understandable when it's twitching here and there. But when I tell you the whole tail of the fish legit moved and the first time it did it it creeped me the hell out like it creeped me out but um and like i said if you watch closer you can see it kind of move it's like this fish moved more when it was dead 
when it was alive, it wasn't moving like that. But when it was dead, this thing was really moving and grooving, bro. Like, Loki, it took me a while to finish cutting it up. I ain't gonna lie to you. And, and this is why I say sturgeon might be the hardest fish to kill because this thing just would not die. Like, even after I cut off its whole side, it was still moving. And I was like, catfish would never. Catfish are hard to kill too, but this one just wouldn't die. And then if you see the meat on the plate, it was still moving. That meat was still moving, bro. The fish legit didn't stop moving until it was actually in the pan getting cooked. You know, as you see in the screen, my brother, he got so impatient, he just started cutting the fish. He was like, bro, forget this. I'm going to just start cutting stuff. But uh, it was actually pretty good. This is the finished product of it. We had three flavors. We had lemon, Cajun, and crispy. Honestly, the crispy and the Cajun was like the best ones. This fish also does not have a lot of bones in it, so you can actually enjoy it while you're eating. You don't because I don't know about y'all, even though fish with bone in it is good, but the bones just get irritated because you're like enjoying the meat and then there's a bone, so you have to keep stopping. But for sturgeon, you can just enjoy it. There's not that many bones in it. Um, The first batch, it was okay in my opinion, but the second and third batch was the one. So I give this fish a solid 9 out of 10 if cooked properly. If it cooked okay, it's like a 7. But if you cook this thing how it's supposed to be cooked, you actually get the taste like... Because it's like it's tender... But at the same time, it's still like a firm meat. Like, it's so weird, but it's, it's, it's really good. And it doesn't even have that fishy taste that, you know, we all come to love. So thank you guys for tuning in. Like, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for more vlogs. Better off a dead man if I ain't getting money. All I know is step when shit. I got dope, know who I know. You can get it from me. Put a 10 in my hand, show you really love me. No cho, I can't comprehend it. I be trapping, I gotta get it, my taste expensive. I've been up for three days, the road be